Mzansi donations have been trickling in for TV actor Vusi Tanda, who appealed for the public for financial assistance. Now, Tanda, who's 71 years old, who's famous for his role of Chawe in SBC1 sitcom Mzini was in Sizwa, dropped a video pleading for assistance. The actor even shared his banking details and thanked people in advance for their generosity. And since then, Good Samaritans have responded by transferring money to his Capitec account. Speaking to Sowetan Live, he sounded relieved and pleased allegedly that donations have totaled 100,000 rands. Hey, hey, Mzansi. Hello and welcome to Entertainment News, Mzansi. If you're new to my channel, you know you have for the stories. Go ahead, click the subscribe button and, uh, of course, the bell. And you'll never miss an update. Ndifuna ubulela abantu bonke nge ngebakazi engaka. Meaning, I want to thank those who donated for such generosity. Now, their donations have reached 100,000 rand and I am thankful thankful for that. I don't care about those who have criticized me for asking for help from the public. These are people who called themselves friends, but they were not there when I needed them. Some of them knew my situation, but they never assisted me, he said. Now, Tanda, who hails from the Eastern Cape, said his financial use were a result of the lack of acting roles. He last acted in 2021 in Mojo Love production, Ikaya Labadala. He last filmed with the Queen in 2020. The seasoned actor said things have been difficult for him since he fell sick suffering from diabetes in 2020. Now, Tanda, who lives with his two sons, with one being unemployed and the other still at school, survives on his pension money of 1,985 per month when roles do not come by. Now, he lives in a two-bedroom flat in Ruidiput that costs 5,000 rand monthly. What pushed him to plead for help was the harassment he has been getting from the landlord because he owes rent money. In our industry, if you're not shooting, you won't get paid. When I appealed to South Africans, it was because I had no choice. I was sitting here on my bed on Tuesday when I heard a very rude knock on my door. When I opened it, it was my landlord wanting his rent money. I had not been able to pay rent since last year. I owe the landlord about 45,000 rent. The pension money that I survived on is not enough to buy groceries, pay for my son's school fees, his transport, and buy diabetic medication. Last year, I had to shoot Ikaya Labadala, not feeling well because I needed the money. This year, I have not even auditioned because there are no roles for people of my age. Now, Tanda said in the earlier years of his career, he was also working as a producer and doing voiceovers. He said, over over the years, as things changed in the industry, he was forced to survive with the acting, with his acting skills only. Yikes, Mzansi. Now, after the whole COVID thing, Mzansi, I think a lot of people realize that they only are a paycheck away from just dwindling down when it comes to finances. It must have been especially difficult for those in the arts and sporting fields. Then the minister who's supposed to help these people um, just wants to, wants to spend money on... Uh, a bloody flagpole. Imagine Mzansi. Now Mzansi, I feel for him, I really do, but uh, this is looking like it's going to be a norm with every celebrity. Once they go through hard times, we have homeless people out there who every day wake up not knowing if they will have something to eat that day or go back to sleep later with empty stomachs. We have poor school kids who actually go hungry every day and still manage to attend classes and they walk to school. We have poor normal citizens who cannot even make ends meet and are forever depressed. But once a celebrity cries everybody jumps up to donate yane the struggle is real and who is going to help those normal people and normal citizens and normal school kids who don't have you know um social media accounts and people who can retweet to help them let me know mzansi what you think about this uh, opinion of mine that i've just expressed uh, on the comment section below but before you go Please make sure you click on the face that's on the screen to make sure that it will take you to my new channel where you can just please subscribe. I promise you, I will be bringing you really, really good content on that channel. But for now, you know, I will bring you the updates hot just the way you like it.